Welcome to today's video. I am going to bring you along with me today as I stop by Walmart to see what kind of fall decor they have because I need a few more items. Well, do I really need a few more items? I don't know, but I want a few more items. So I am going to see what they have and I'll show you if I get anything. And I also want to show you a few more items that I picked up from a few other stores. So let's go see what they have. So I am at my local Walmart and they have all of the fall and Halloween decor together in one area. They do have a lot of things to choose from. So I'm just going to share a few of the things that they have today that really kind of caught my eye. And the first thing that I saw were these beautiful stacked pumpkins. They are fabric and plaid. They are a cream color with a little rust colored maple leaf at the top. These would go great with some neutral decor. I thought they were really, really cute for the price. And there is an orange one that is plaid also. It's just like the cream one. And these are $11.98. I don't know. I might have to grab one of these because they are so cute and would be very cute in my living room. Moving on, um, they have a lot of different things pumpkins scarecrows lanterns all of the good things for fall but the next thing that i saw were these pretty floral arrangements mainly because of the cost the first one is this pumpkin arrangement that has a large sunflower on it these were five dollars and 98 cent they have beautiful leaves very neutral colors and a white pumpkin with the flowers sitting inside so i thought this would make a very good piece to go on your table or on a shelf or as an accent piece they also have a lot of different lanterns um, and I think I'll show you those in a little while. But the next floral arrangement was this cute one with the gold vase and the gold ribbon. It was $6.98. Next to that are all of the small pumpkins and little picks that you can use in floral arrangements. And the small pumpkins could just be accent pieces. And they were $1.14. And all of the little picks were a dollar and 38 cent. And I thought that was a very good price. And they had a lot of different colors, like this light orange one with the green leaves. That was very cute. It had some raffia detail on the back. And then they had the darker orange one with these white berries. And then I saw in the back a little white pumpkin. Um, a pick that had a lot of little raffia and some berries as well so those would look cute in an arrangement then the pumpkins were very cute again they were a dollar 14 and they had a lot of different shapes sizes colors i thought this one was quite interesting i've never seen a pumpkin like that but the color i uh, was black and orange they had this dark orange one they had light orange ones, yellow ones, and cream ones, and they had a lot of uh, different ones. The bigger ones on the bottom were $7.98. I also saw these cute little turkeys that would be cute on your table for Thanksgiving. It had little feathers on it. These were $3.98, and they also had a little porcupine with spikes on his back. <laughs> He was a cute as well. 
Don't really know about him, but he was cute. These wooden thankful signs were $7.44 and would look cute on a door or leaning in your kitchen. Also, this hello wreath. Uh, the price wasn't showing right there, but they were $24.99. And we'll see those again in a minute. And this wooden table decor, this pumpkin was $3.00 and 98 cent we are moving on to these led strobe lights it said try me and so i was trying to figure out how to try them at first i thought they were string lights until i read that they were strobe lights and i finally did figure out how to turn them on and so you'll see it's kind of like a blinking headlight i'm not quite sure how that works but they were $4.98. So if you're interested in those, they have those as well. Here's that wreath again. They kind of had these <laughs> spread all over. I think people have been picking them up and looking at them and maybe just kind of sticking them in different places. But here's where I saw that it was $24.98. And then they have this cute little stuffed hedgehog i don't know whether he was a hedgehog or a porcupine and then these bigger pumpkins they look like the smaller ones but they're bigger and this one i thought was really really cute because i don't know if you can tell but it has gold a sort of iridescent shine to it so it's not just a cream pumpkin it has some gold on it and it was seven dollars and 98 cent as well and here I'm just showing you all of the different variety of pumpkins. And this one was kind of out of place, but I thought it was cute. It was another stacked pumpkin decor piece with a larger cream pumpkin on the bottom, an orange pumpkin in the middle, and a small cream pumpkin at the top. And I thought it was very pretty with the leaves coming out of the top of it. This pumpkin was really cute. It was really had it really had an odd shape so I thought that was uh, really cute that might be really cute on a tabletop and just an example of some of the smaller pumpkins that were three dollars and 98 cents These small black and white fabric pumpkins are five dollars and 44 cent think they are very cute as well uh, moving on they have more pumpkins all over down at the bottom all on the floor and then they had these baskets that were very cute floral arrangements and the baskets are $24.54 as well as these colorful wreaths and then the little wooden squares some things like this I have on my coffee bar. They're $2.98. And they had a variety of those. They also had this metal pumpkin that I thought was really, really pretty. And it has a floral arrangement on the inside. And these were $14.98. Um, you could use this as a centerpiece on a table or your coffee table, your kitchen table your dining room table but for $14.87 I thought that was a very very good price and then these little wooden hangers were $4.77 you could use these on a door or hanging in your bedroom really anywhere and they say fall is in the air I thought these were cute if you want those and they were four dollars and 77 cent they also had a different one hanging beside it as well moving on to these little ceramic table place settings that's what i think they're like place cards and you might use them for something else but i thought they were so cute and they're only two dollars and 24 cent it would look good on your thanksgiving table or if you're having a dinner party at a place setting as a place setting and then this black and white pumpkin patch sign uh, was ten dollars and 88 cent i love things like this maybe on your coffee bar or on a table 
and then these little sweater pumpkins were so cute look at the different colors they had three different colors white green and orange and they were six dollars and 98 cents i might have to pick up one of these and here's another hanging basket floral basket and again those were 24 dollars as well and then there's a random halloween costume stuck in uh, and then they had these cute little uh ceramic candle holders and back to our pretty lanterns this lantern was $14.44 and it does light up. And if you can see me pressing the little button to test it, to light it up, these would be so cute on your fireplace or at the bottom of a table. And these larger lanterns were only $17.98. Those are so pretty and they have the floral arrangement already inside so if you are looking for a lantern for a good price if you can catch them still at walmart run and get you one now this is the most interesting thing that i saw these carvable pumpkins so these are uh, fall decor but you can carve these pumpkins just like a real pumpkin i have never seen these before so you'll have to tell me in the comments is if this is walmart's first year having these but they had three different colors they had black they had gold and they had burgundy and they came in different sizes and these are twelve dollars and 98 cent and so the description says that you can carve them just like you can carve a real pumpkin. Uh, so, and as you can see here on the display, they're using them for a craft. You could take the top off and make a floral arrangements. You could make a jack-o'-lantern. Yeah, so I thought these were really cool and would be really, really fun to play with. Okay, we're back home and i want to show you what i got from walmart um i also ended up picking up a few other things not today but just a few other things that i want to add to my fall decor so i'm going to start with the items that i picked up from walmart i did not pick up that many because i've already i already have so many pumpkins and things but I saw a few items that I did like. So let me show you what I have. The first thing that I picked up was this cute stacked fabric pumpkin. I think that it is so cute. Um, it's cream and it has um, brown and taupe plaid, um, a brown and taupe plaid pattern on it. I thought it's so cute. And then it does have this orange maple leaf at the top um so i went ahead and picked that up and this one was how much was this one was eleven dollars and 84 cent so i have fun decorating seven that. cent is just a um small cream pumpkin that is plastic it really is kind of giving off a a yellowish tone to me so i'm really not sure about it um, it could just be my lighting right now, but when I saw it, I really Pumpkin liked it. for $7.84. This is a cream pumpkin, and you really, I don't know if you can tell in the video, but there are some iridescent gold details on it, um, and it's a little bit larger. So this one was $7.44. The last um, thing that I picked up from Walmart was this small cream pumpkin with a little floral decor on it. It has a sunflower. Um, it says pumpkin with floral, and it was $5.87. So um, I thought that was cute. Not quite sure where I'm going to put it, but I thought it was cute. I also picked up one other thing from Hobby Lobby. These um, green stems, um, and the name of them, let's see if I can see what's on there. It, it doesn't say, but these were um, $9.99 and they were 50% off. So fall is now 50% off, but I thought they were very pretty. Um, they are green and they have um, 
some yellow detail in there. So I thought those would be pretty for her, um, for harvest, for fall in one of my vases. Uh, I also have a couple of items from Ross. I went to Ross the other day and picked up a few things. Um, I needed a few more things for my bedroom and for um, my landing area upstairs. And so I just wanted to see if they had anything left and they've kind of condensed all of their fall items to one area at the front of the store, but I did manage to pick up a few things that I liked. So here they are. Um, the first thing that I got was this gold um, handcrafted pumpkin from India. It is gold and it's sitting on a wood base. I thought that was so cute um, to maybe sit on a shelf. And this was only $6.99. So I thought that was cute. I also picked up from Ross um, a couple pumpkins. And this first one is this sweater pumpkin. I thought it was so precious. I'm not, y'all, I'm not quite sure about this rope um, stem. It's kind of long in my opinion, it almost looks like a braid, but I thought it was really cute and it's $8.99. It was $8.99. So that goes very well with my decor. I also picked up this other um, pumpkin. It's like a boucle material fabric, and it was $8.99 as well. And then just a couple more pumpkins, and I promise I'm done with the pumpkins. Um, I saw this orange ceramic pumpkin that I thought was absolutely beautiful. Um, they did have a larger green one. Um, it was more like a mint green and not a sage green. That's why I didn't pick it up. But um, this one was only $5.99. Um, and I think it's very pretty. Um, I think you can tell how shiny it is. Um, it's ceramic and then it has a gold stem. So I'm not sure where I'm going to put it, but I'm excited to find out. So I picked that up. And then the last thing that I picked up as far as pumpkins was this pretty white ceramic pumpkin and it lights up and um, it has a brown stem. Let's see. I'm not sure if you can tell, but isn't that cute at the bottom? Um, it turns on, it has two watch batteries in there so you can turn it on and off. Um, so I think I want to put this on my entryway table. And this was only $9.99. I almost got both of them, but I, I didn't. I don't need both of them. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put it, but I thought this was very cute um, for $10. So the last thing that I picked up from Ross were the, it's not, it, well, they weren't in the fall section, but I picked up these, um, faux books i think these are so nice i love them um they are all the same um but i they had three sizes um a big one a medium one and a small one and um the big one i don't know if you can tell but it's it's pretty big and this one was um 12.99 and um, they do open so you can store things in there. And then there's a medium size one. This medium one was $10.99. And then the smaller one was um, $8.99. And so I'm excited to use these, not just for fall, um, but these will be so cute on a bookcase um, or on a table, a side table, just for decor. Um, I just thought for the price, and I have actually been looking for something like this, um, these were great to add to my decor stash. The last two items that I wanna share with you today are from a um, local department store called Belk that we have here in town. I also order from them online. I purchased two blankets from them. The first one is this boucle throw. 
in a caramel color. I'm going to use this either on the couch or on the chair in my room or on the bench that we have in our family room. So this was on clearance for $11 and then I think I got an extra 15% off or something. So it ended up being $8 and it is a 50 by 60 throw. It feels so incredibly soft. So I'm excited to be able to use that. Um, and I also purchased this quilt and the brand is um, Goodness and Grace. And I have a king size bed, but I purchased this quilt in a queen size because I just want to situate it on the end of our bed. We're not actually going to sleep on it, but we can use it to cuddle up or um, one of us can curl up under it, but it will go on my bed as decor um, with my fall decor. And that is all that I have in this last minute fall haul. I know I said I wasn't gonna buy anything else, but I don't think I promised. So I think I'm done with purchasing things for fall. So stick around if you want to see how I use these items as I decorate our house for fall. I would love to have you join our little family. I am trying to grow my YouTube channel. So if you would click like and subscribe and come along the journey with me as we explore lifestyle, home, family, fashion, decor, all the good things. I appreciate you watching and see you next time.